So here's the standard vertical milling machine. So the first thing we'll do is we'll identify the main parts of it. So we have here the pan, which collects water and coolant. Underneath we have the base, the cast iron structure. We have the column. This here is the knee, which moves up and down on the column. We have the saddle, which traverses across the knee. We have the table, our, our vise. We have um, here the main head of the milling machine. We have our spindle in here. So the spindle, through a drawbar, holds our chuck. And our control center, we have manual control for um, longitudinal movement. And here is for traversing. And this handle here allows the saddle, or allows the knee, to move up and down on the column. First thing we need to do is grease our slides. So we have a hydraulic pump here, and it's good practice in a couple of pumps just before you start. Here's actually running low on oil, which is indicated on it here. So with a couple of pumps just to grease all the slides. So it's very important as well before you start out is to ensure that the device is, is, uh, is running parallel to the longitudinal axis. So we do this by inserting a dial test indicator in here. We'll put in a parallel inside of the chuck and we'll clock it. 